B.F. Skinner. He was an American psychologist whose thinking was influenced by the work of Ivan Pavlov and John B. Watson. Skinner championed a return to Watson's strict focus on observable behaviour. Skinner did not deny the existence of internal mental events. However, he insisted that they could not be studied scientifically. Moreover, there is no need to study them. According to Skinner, if the stimulus of food is followed by the response of eating, we can fully describe what is happening without making any guesses about whether the animal is experiencing hunger. Like Watson, Skinner also emphasized how environmental factors mold behavior. The fundamental principle of behavior documented by Skinner is deceptively simple. Organisms tend to repeat responses that lead to positive outcomes, and they tend not to repeat responses that lead to neutral or negative outcomes. Despite its simplicity, this principle turns out to be quite powerful. Working primarily with lab rats and pigeons trained in operant conditioning devices that came to be known as Skinner boxes, he showed that he could exert remarkable control over the behavior of animals by manipulating the outcomes of their responses. He was even able to train animals to perform unnatural behaviors. For example, he once trained some pigeons to play a credible version of ping pong. That's a bit adorable. Skinner's followers eventually showed that the principles uncovered in their animal research could be applied to complex human behaviors as well. Behavioral principles are now widely used in factories, schools, prisons, mental hospitals, and a variety of other settings. Skinner's ideas had repercussions that went far beyond the debate among psychologists about what they should study. Skinner spelled out the full implications of his foundings in his book, Beyond Freedom and Dignity, published in 1971. There he asserted that all behavior is fully governed by external stimuli. In other words, your behavior is determined in predictable ways by lawful principles, just as the flight of an arrow is governed by the laws of physics. Thus, if you believe that your actions are the result of conscious decisions, you're wrong. According to Skinner, people are controlled by their environment, not by themselves. In short, Skinner arrived at the conclusion that free will is an illusion. Hope you enjoyed this. This excerpt was taken from Psychology, Themes and Variations by Wayne Wheaton. Thank you.